World Post Day is here again, bringing back a host of nostalgic memories. The theme for 2022 World Post Day is Post for Planet. On this special occasion, we are immensely happy to feature the Postal Man of Bless, C.P. Thomas. One of the main pillars in introducing Speed Post in India. Born in Kotayam, Kerala in 1934, he had his graduation from CMS Kotayam, followed by post-graduation from MCC Chennai. Though he wanted to be a journalist, destiny took him on a different route. First as a lecturer in Music College Alwa and later on, he took the path of civil service exams of which he opted the Indian Postal Service. He began his service as Superintendent of Post Office and served as Director, Postmaster General, Deputy Director General for Post and Telecom in an illustrious postal career, spanning over 32 years. The idea of Speed Post was born in my mind after reading about it in the other countries. This is not, there are many countries in Europe and other continents where Speed Post is already there. It was already there. Then I saw no reason why we should not have it. It is not technologically difficult. Once I developed this idea, I showed it to some of my colleagues in the directorate of POST. And they all thought the same that I thought. That is, it is possible to um, work it out and implement without any loss to the government. With this, I was emboldened to work out, to write out in detail the, um, the scheme for uh, Speed Post and put it up to the member of the Postal Services Board in charge. The reception of uh, this idea was not very warm. In fact, he was very discouraging. And he said, uh, Thomas, why have you worked out all this? Nobody asked you to do this. And secondly, do you think that the members here are so under underworked that they can take more, take on more work? Braving the odds, he took his proposal directly to the union cabinet. He had served in many places across the country. Bombay, Gujarat, Rajkot, Baroda, Kollam, Kashmir, Delhi, to name a few. A man with a bold futuristic approach and viewpoints was often a subject of discussion among his colleagues. One of his major contributions was a change of uniform color for the postal workers. A voracious reader, he is fond of Indian history and had a passion for literature and history of religions. His philosophy was If you have if a person has clear ideas about what is required to be done, then it is not difficult for him to work it out and implement it. The Bless family is proud and privileged to have Mr. Thomas on our phone.